Welcome to our Freedom From Suffering Now blog. I'm Dr. Steve Grinstead. You know, I was thinking today, I worked with several people who had chronic pain and coexisting addiction, and it took me back to thinking about what was going on with me in the 1990s, right before I started developing the addiction-free pain management system. I remember at the time I was working at several universities in the San Jose area and Santa Cruz area and had access to all their libraries. I was also uh, teaching over at Stanford Medical School, so I had access to their library too. What I wanted to do was to see what I could find published on people who were living with chronic pain and coexisting disorders when they went in to get help. And it was a very frustrating time because after almost a full month of cruising all the different uh, resources at the four major libraries, I came up with nothing. And I was kind of complaining about it to my friend and colleague, Terry Gorski, and he says, well, Steve, looks like you've got to go out and do some of your own research and then write it up and publish it. And that's what I did. And one of the things I discovered, and that's what I'm blogging about today, is the addiction pain syndrome. You know, if you're watching this on YouTube, please go to the link below to read the entire blog post. Also, if you want to go more in depth than that covers, there's a link also below this video to go check out my book, Managing Pain and Coexisting Disorders. Learn more about this addiction pain syndrome. It's a synergistic effect that happens when people live with chronic pain and coexisting addiction. It's where no longer can you get one plus one equals two. Now you have the synergism, one plus one equals three or more. And unfortunately, most of the treatment with this population is done either in addiction programs, pain clinics, or sometimes they cross refer. And the best we get when we do that is two thirds of the problem is managed. We miss that synergistic zone I called the addiction pain syndrome. So please check it out, learn more, and please share this with anybody you know that might be in recovery or needs to be in recovery because they have chronic pain and coexisting addiction. Thank you very much and please come back frequently for more post updates on my blog. Thank you.